Malaysia has reaped great rewards from the Look East policy, which turns 40 next year, Japan's ambassador to Malaysia, Takahashi Katsuhiko, told FMT during a recent visit to his residence. Katsuhiko said the policy, introduced under then Prime Minister Dr. Mahathir Mohamad, had seen over 26,000 Malaysians study in Japan over the years. So next year will be 40 years since Mahathir introduced the Look East policy. How do you think it's gone over the last four decades? Yes, uh, I think Look East the policy uh, has been bearing a uh, lot of fruit uh, in Malaysia. And I'm, I'm happy to note that those people are playing a very important role uh, in Malaysian society. For example, I checked before the interview that the uh, 24 Secretary General of the governmental organization, uh, among 24, 15 uh, Secretary Generals have experienced education in Japan under the Look East policy. Therefore, governmental side, there are a lot of people who know Japan and uh, who uh, work based upon this policy. On the business side also, I understand a lot of graduates from the Look East policy uh, program uh, playing a very important role uh, in enhancing the bilateral economic relation uh, between the two countries. I'm happy that Look East policy had achieved a lot and I really wish uh, that the new Look East policy after 40 years anniversary uh, to further develop and enhance the bilateral relation. Katsuhiko added that he was happy to be in Malaysia having only arrived a few weeks ago and was keen to engage with people from all walks of life. I, I'm very happy uh, to be posted uh, to Malaysia as an ambassador and uh, in a very important time of 40 years anniversary of Look East policy and the 65th, 65th anniversary for the establishment of the diplomatic relation between the two countries. I'm here uh, to listen to the opinion of all Malaysian people to find out what will be the best way uh, to enhance bilateral relations between the two countries. I'm at your disposal and I'm really looking forward to see everybody in Malaysia. Thank you.